So did you get the wind knocked out of you really bad, or you got some? Yeah, I was uh, I was kind of dazed for a little bit. I got the wind knocked out of me. My helmet hit the ground, but uh, I was all right. Did you feel that set the tone for the game? Um, not really. I mean, we were in it. I mean, we were in it. We had times to make plays, so um, no, not really. Can you talk about Marcus? He was big on third down today for you guys. Yeah, Marcus was big. You know, on you know on the third downs we did convert. You know, he really stepped up and uh, you know got open. You know, we had some good time, and uh, you know I was able to give him the ball. You got the ball batted at the line of scrimmage a lot, or not? What do you think was happening there? Uh, they just, you know. You know, at times, you know, they weren't really rushing. They were just, you know, kind of standing there. They had some big, you know, tall defensive linemen. Um, and they just were putting their hands up. You know, we have to find a way to, you know, not let them do that, find a way to get their hands down. You guys uh, went for that second field goal at the beginning of the fourth quarter. Did you want to go for it? You're on the five yard line. Uh, yeah, I mean, you always want to go, go for it. I mean, as quarterback, um, you know, Coach Riley made the decision not to. Um, do you think that that hurt you, settling for field goals? Oh, uh, definitely hurt us settling for field goals. I mean, we had opportunities before that, you know, on second and third down to, uh, you know, to score. You know, it was just unfortunate we couldn't get the ball in the end zone. Right, talk about the season in general and just, I mean, it was kind of the season what could have been. I mean, you were close against TCU and it was some teams that came out, like the red zone thing, that kind of continued all year. Yeah. Um, it, uh, it was just an up and down season. Um, you know, there was, you know, really good times. Um, but then, you know, there's some really bad times. It's, you know, it's, we have to find a way to, you know, stay consistent and uh, and just even it out. You know, we have to we have to be efficient and just, you know, get the ball in the, in the end zone. What about your thoughts on Oregon's defense today, just the way they played? I mean, they were number one in the country coming in. I mean, did they look that way to you, like the number one team? Yeah, they, I mean they were a good. They were a good football team, you know. Um, you know, give them credit. That was that was they did a good job. You know, we were we were in that game though. You know, it was a uh, we had some opportunities and you know we just didn't capitalize on. You guys have played a lot of top ten teams. Is this the best team you've played all season? Um, today? Yeah, I mean they were. I mean they were a good football team. You know, I'm not going to say anyone was better than you know other team. I mean we played some really good teams, uh, but they were a good football team. What sets them apart from the other ones? I think they have similarities. They're all, they're fast, you know, the big, strong defense, you know, move the ball well. Marcus said he could hardly wait to get going for next year. They have the Rogers brothers back and so much firepower on offense. You kind of feel the same way, or is it too early to think that far? No, not at all. I mean, uh, you know, I'm I'm ready to you know start this thing back up. You know, we're going to take a you know probably a few weeks. You know, just gather ourselves, you know, get healthy and. Uh, We'll we'll be back. I mean, we're definitely we're gonna be fighting. You know, um, this team's gonna work really hard this off season. Thanks, Ryan. Thanks, Ryan. Yeah.